I want to bring something to everyone's attention. In the last video on the farm truck, we had some people after us because we have a truck that blew some smoke on accident. A truck that's driven maybe a couple miles a week. But what if I told you that your child rides in one of these and breathes black smoke every day constantly and also it has no seatbelts? I want to show you all something. Watch this carefully, right? You guys complaining about my truck. Look at this school bus here that picks up our children every day, okay? blowing black smoke look at that our children are on that bus think of the children these are the vehicles that take your kids to and from school every day and they're all rolling coal your kids are constantly breathing this in on a daily basis and there's no seat belts either i don't know the epa has been real quiet about this maybe rolling coal is bad but as long as there's children on the truck it's okay I'm just saying. Now, in the continued quest to find and buy vehicles that people that don't look like me normally drive, we decided to drive about 30 minutes north to a state where there aren't many people that look like me to find this gem, the farm truck. It's a 1965 GMC two-ton truck. Yes, two tons. It's got a ton on the square body dually, which is also a huge truck, but this one makes the dually look small. It's powered by a 12-valve Cummins, and if you watched the last episode, we put it on the dyno with nitrous and made a whole lot of power. <laughs> We even put it to the test. We let Linda drive it and her foot slipped and the truck let out a cloud of black smoke. But thankfully, we gave the EPA her address so they can send her the fines. But this truck is almost 60 years old and unlike your dad, it's still cool. Every part of this is cool. The shifter, the tires, the interior, the bed, everything. And we want to make it even cooler. So we're going to do some tasteful modifications to enhance its beauty. But the only not cool thing about this truck is it blowing smoke. So today, we're going to do our best to stop it from doing that. So we're going to fix this truck, but we're also going to make a website with Squarespace. It's easy to claim a domain or URL like www. I'm sorry, Mother Earth. I will plant a tree every time I start the truck.com or www, but I'd rather have this instead of rivian.com. So you can create a custom site that matches your style and enthusiasm. Check out these page templates because it'll make your web page look better than the faces of people that thought this was a Tesla channel and come back years later to no less than five diesel trucks. Head to www.squarespace.com slash fisherybuilds to save 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain using the code in the description box below. Shout out to Squarespace for making platforms for people's passions, no matter how green they are. Yeah, it matches the Mini Cooper up there. It really does. It really does. Steven, I um, I need your expertise for something. What's that? I um. What's the meaning of this? I really want to make the farm truck look a little bit more. What's what's how that? You, what's that gesture? Spruce up. You know what I mean? Ah, okay. And I think one way we could do that. I think we should consider doing the bed over. And I know okay. you're a woodsman. You I like wood. the woods. I do. You like the woods, but you also work with wood as well. Like you've been cutting and doing all that kind of stuff. Let's see what Steven can do. Pretty cool. I'd like you to add that magic to the bed of the truck. Let's take a look-see. Let's take a gander, shall we? It's silvered. You're not a fan of the, the bleached it, uh, sun look? No, I think we should. I think standing it would be kind of cool. Okay. Because of what's happening is you see all the, the diesel and all the random stains here. I kind what of, are those? What are those from? I, 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 what are those? I have no idea. But I think it'd be really neat to kind of just clean it up because remember, this wood is the person that designed the bed. It's a very, very cool looking bed. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, if you look at this underneath, look at this. Oh, yeah. This bed is permanently welded to the frame. Oh. There is no way this bed could come off. Not only that, but the wood that they put here, it's completely encapsulated in this uh, quarter inch <laughs> thick steel. So I these see. cannot be removed. So over time, these are gonna crack and just eventually disintegrate. It might take a while, but I'd like to preserve this because I don't think this truck is going anywhere. We're we gonna answer the age old question of, of uh, are we gonna convert it? <sighs> no. <This truck> <laughs> No, people laugh because it's it's that's the the cool thing to do now is convert everything to electric, and 
this truck should never be electric. If, if it was electric, it would need at least minimum a thousand horsepower. It would have to be plaid swapped. I mean, look at her. Yeah, this is a, come on. Come on, man. Come on, Steven. She's a survivor. She's a survivor, man. They don't, they'll never make truck like this ever again. No. Never. There's no seat belts. We die like men, this thing. Yeah. You know? No, she's a, she's a real gem. She's a real gem. I got some stuff in there. Oh, yeah, you do. I still have Linda's. Oh, Linda. Linda cakes and stuff. Come on, Linda. She left those behind? Come on, Linda. These are also for sale. I need to sat on these. <laughs> oh, perfect. Well, if you rub your fingers on this, you will mm -hmm. get splinters immediately. I don't want to do that now. Well, you should try it just so, so you feel my pain. Yeah, I got one. So we should sand it. Sand it, stain it, seal it. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> Steven, uh, the current standards we're using I think it's gonna take a little bit longer than I thought. Uh, I don't have anything lower than 320 grit, and this is not working for this, so. Well, we could go to the, the, the Harm Depot. 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 We, get, <laughs> we go to Harm Depot and see what they have there for okay. standing and stuff. Let's look at different colors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Because uh, I remember you were saying on the way over here you wanted something really dark. Yeah, I like, I don't know why, but. I like things dark. Yeah, that's fair. You know what okay. I mean? Me too. Do you? Steven, this is a deck, right? So we need decking stuff. Um, what color should we choose? I mean, if I'm being honest with you, we should be using tongue oil or linseed oil. Don't be oil. honest with me, Steven. We're gonna use this decking stuff. I don't um, <laughs> Let's use the- I mean, I guess it works. It's, um, I mean, it's, it's, it's a deck, right? Tomato, tomato. It's yeah. a deck. It's, yeah. a, it's, a, it's the deck and it's the bed. It's the deck of a truck. Deck. And look, look, ready, watch. What we want is we'll use, what's higher, maximum or elite? Technically maximum would be, but right, according to the warranties. Yeah, that's a lifetime guarantee and this is four years, six years. So who, who's doing there? this? Yeah, who, who's who designed this? Elite is better than maximum. I mean, maximum should be the top. Right. No, I mean, elite, elite means they both be, they're both winners. I, I guess not. Let's have the studio audience decide what color we're going to pick. What do you guys think? Wenge? Perfect. Thank you. <laughs> Pirate Wenge. Well, I think it looks kind of good, actually. I like it. Go for it. Penis. Like, I want to actual penis. Bro. Magnifique. <laughs> Let's do it. Same thing. Is Just it? It's covered up. If you eat it five guys, this is what you look like. Every day, right? Huh. It's kind of fast. It's kind of fast. And so can you. I didn't know. Let's go have a milkshake. I don't like McDonald's. God damn it! Oh, what, 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 do you, what do you want? Huh? What do you want? A milkshake. Oh, Steven, we made it back. We did. Explain Home to Depot, the people man. what's going to happen next. Well, we decided... Well! There's two ways to do this. Yes. There's the easy way. Yep. Easy way. Or the, next, what are, you, what are you showing me here? Well, this is a planer. So this little, this little gem right here, adjustable down here. Mm -hmm. This little death blade. Ah! Ooh. So this sucker, we run this to court. Wrong here with uh, with the grain, and we'll be able to just kind of get the wood right back to its original form. Oh, I like that. Form. You already started there. It looks pretty good. Yeah. That's, that's All right, try it. Let's naked see what oak. Can... That's what naked oak looks Let's like. Let's see what happens. What does clothed oak look like? <laughs> So what do you think of this thing? I freaking love it. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, it's, it's messy in there, uh, but it's functional. Hey, it's a truck. Yeah, it's a truck, right? You put it to work. I like the uh, shit to stand off. Pretty cool, huh? <laughs> this is great. 
Absolutely. Right? Why not? Definitely. It's leaking oil everywhere. That's cool, right? You guys just, just put some sand on it. That's what comes to. It's not going to rust, though. Yeah, right. Well, that's for sure. No. Uh, why, why is that bar there? There you go. Oh. Perfect. I left that giant pipe here for like two hours, and then finally I'm like, I kind of ain't tripping over, and I just moved to see my hands are still dirty. Just <laughs> <laughs> gotta make it. I made the decision. Okay. I made my. He's choice. happy with this one. <laughs> Friggin' diesel one. Oh, the guy is not the. Maybe we should. Maybe we should cut it though. That's the thing. Fresh shave. That's not you. <laughs> no, it's not you me. look feral. Thank you. <laughs> not like twelve. Damn! Down the truck. Damn, boy. Thanks, man. It's gonna look great. Oh, that's easy. Boom, done. Piece of cake. We did it. Look at this. Strap her in. Look at that. All 10 inches. I mean, 10 feet. 10 feet, like it's no big deal. You know a lot about that. Just huh? handled that. Yep. It's not going anywhere. You gotta tap the pipe too, though. It's not it, going it, anywhere. He said it. He says it's not going anywhere. It's not going anywhere. That's why I like to hear. I'm just impressed by these tires. Yeah. Yeah. yeah they're they're uh, fun to drive with no power steering. I'll tell you that. Much. <laughs> yeah. You gotta really get the thing moving. <laughs> it's not a scratch and sniff, is it? Yeah, I hope it is. What's that smell? Damn. Like? It smells like what it looks like, honestly. Does it? Yeah. Damn. Put it up to the camera. Dude, smell, let, smell let, it. Let them know. We should tell people why we're doing this. All right, so. The EPA came down on us hard. We got in big trouble from the EPA. So what they told us was we can't have black smoke being emitted from the vehicle. Right. No matter what year. Right. So instead of having the pipe go out the side, because people walk around here. Yeah, that's, that's, people that's, if you're, if you have a baby stroller coming. Right. It's smog. Stroller, or if you're riding a bike, Run there's just infant. smog everywhere, yep. right? Can't so have what that. we're going to do is we're going to put uh, some baffles in this pipe to remove like the black smoke. And instead of shooting at people's faces, we're going to shoot it directly into the atmosphere. Belch and filth into the sky. Right into the sky. So instead of, I mean, this is at least another what? That's like what? Five, about five feet. We're going to move the exhaust tip five feet up. So instead of people's faces, We'll go right to the clouds. Right. Yeah. Right. Where, where it belongs. Why waste time? Yeah. Right. And I mean, you have dark clouds when it rains. Exactly. That's, so that's the logic. Put, we're going to put some stuff in here, too, to kind of baffle it up so yeah. we can get the black smoke and um, maybe a little bit of charcoal, some steel wool, and we should, we should be good to go. Yes. That's going on, too. This is also going to help further remove all the things going on. Yeah, the yeah. Environment. It doesn't allow it to all go out. It doesn't. So, so all of it's going to stay here on the cover of this Yeah, cap. that's what it does. Yeah. So... Yes. Clearly. Yes. <laughs> it's not supposed to laugh at you. It's very serious. serious business. Very serious. That's the first mount. It's not mounted there. That's a wannabe mount. Uh, let's pretend. I don't know what they're thinking there. Well, you know. And it's... the rest we cut. I think we should cut the pipe first. So we should cut the pipe. Oh. Not exactly where it needs to go, but right before it. Maybe like right here. Yeah. And then after we cut that, we can take the remainder of the back half off. Yep. And that's it. Just squirrel it right out. Oh, hand me a blade. Can you hold it up, man? Is there another hanger? I'll kill you. Okay. So the hanger. Yeah. Who does that? Well, seven hangers? I mean, they want to stay put. Remember, they don't make things like they used to. I know, apparently not. This was built with pride. Yeah, I see the other one. There you go. Now we okay. gotta get that, don't we? Wow. Yeah, that thing's now just floppy jalopy until we put our uh, 45 on it. Yeah. My God, did that smell good. Why are you positioned that way? I have to hold the thing from walking. What are you doing? What's up, man? 
What are you doing? Steven, I'm shipping some stuff. Come over here, Steven. We're working on a project. I've started a new store on Etsy. Why? <laughs> you know, make some extra cash, you know what I mean? You know what? Uh, yeah, right. I'm shipping a bunch of stuff. I didn't make these things. I, actually, I can see that. actually things that already exist and I'm shipping them. You know what I'm using? Ship station. Is that a sock? Yeah, it is a sock. Someone actually want to buy one of my socks? Do not. That's, you know, weird about that? It was 20 bucks. Not really. The going is good. See what ship station. You know what I get? I get the same discounts that Fortune 500 companies get, Steven. Also, also, I could use FedEx, UPS, USPS, and even international shipping, Steven. It's great. Is that where those are going? So I could ship these sugar flakes and apple bits to kids in different countries that don't cocoa have ball. access these to cocoa balls. These are real versions of the cereal. Mm-hmm. They're not. You give them knockoff? <laughs> nope. That's what they get. Wow. They don't know any better. Anyways, so... <laughs> so, <that's it. laughs> so go to shipstation.com slash for free bills, Steven, and you could get a two-month free trial. 60 days. Who wouldn't do that? Make sure it happens, Steven. Hmm? Make it happen. I didn't, I didn't make that up. Yeah, I know. But you should make it happen. So check them out. I have to watch something. Oh. I'll be right back. All right, So, all right. After we cut this piece here, we take the 90, or the second 90. Yeah, I'll hold that. You hold this. So we have to cut that down a little bit. We actually, we'll know. Is that where we want it to come out? Um, let me see. Make sure. I have to make sure it lines I'll, up I'll with the body. I'll back. I'll tell you in a second. All right. So if that's about where it's going to be. How about that there? Like, what do you think? Right about there. I'll bring it so it doesn't go over the flare of the door. What do you think? That's that's the right spot in my opinion. You could even you could go back a few inches, honestly right too. You could probably bring it to about here, and then that's as far as it can go. All right, so we're gonna cut this ten footer down to a six footer, so you know we can go under bridges and whatnot. You got a sharp egg? It was never seen again. Can't hold a tape, a phone. And that simultaneously. It's destined to fail. Oh, thanks. Okay. We're getting there, Steven. It's, uh, yeah, we're relo getting there. Relocating some pipe. Yeah, so we gotta bring this up. We gotta put a hanger here. Right there, put a hanger. And then we're also gonna hang it right here too. So it mounts to the bed. And then, yeah. Mm. You like that song? This just sounds kinda cool. That sounds kinda cool, doesn't it? It does. I'm a fan of that. I'm a big fan. All right, so what we've done is we've halfway reamed through the holes and then bored through it so that we can get this. The hanger's gonna line up on that. And then we'll be able to get some washers on these and have the nuts come through and hold that in place. And we're actually gonna mount the pipe, the exhaust pipe, to this back bracket. Uh, the dilemma was... Do we dare I, ever? I didn't, I, I couldn't do it. <laughs> couldn't Look, do it this, this cab, this is 1965. Right. There was no rust in these floorboards. Exactly. So, oh, oh are, you, are you protecting? No, this is something I'm pointing out over there. It's just it's the thing. See? Oh, oh, I see. See it? Yeah, yeah. All right. Anyways, you can move your hand now. These floorboards are not rusted, and uh, we do not want to put any holes in here, regardless of how good we are at uh, gumming them up. Yeah. Because, well, we want to protect the integrity of the truck. Yes. So this was the route to take for sure. So we have this here, and then the exhaust is actually going to mount to this. Correct. Is it going to catch fire? Maybe. Yeah, you know, I mean, we could heat shield it if we need to. Do you call Tavares for something? He has that gold foil. Yeah, he really loves gold foil. He loves it. I love gold! It's only a matter of time before he gets gold teeth. He's really gonna... God already, bless you, Freddy. I think he already has gold teeth. Does he? Yeah, I don't... All right, maybe. All right, so how do we do this again? Very carefully. Like... No, I'm not gonna bother. I know what you're gonna say. Uh, do you? It kind of says something totally different. What were you gonna say? Puffin fish, mate. Pufferfish? Oh yeah, that's a good point. Well, when they're not, when they're flaccid, they don't, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, yeah they're it's okay. Fine. Yeah, when, if, you're, if they're excited. Yeah. Sticking with the pointy end. Have to mount the uh, bracket on before we get to our Which bracket? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Anyways. Go ahead. 90. 90. 
90. You see that? It's precision. A perfect shaft. If you really cool, you put a little rubber duck at the top of that flat. A what? A little rubber duck at the top of the flat. If you want to. You'll, you'll smelt it over time, but... Uh. Here we go. Not bad. It's time. It's time. It's time. It's time. All right. Here goes nothing. The truck might explode. Let's keep that in mind. All right. Ready? Oh, I'm beyond ready. <laughs> <laughs> Steven, we forgot the baffles. Oh! Oh, those are supposed to be in there, of course. Ah, damn! Oh, of See, course. The... I mean, <sighs> well. What we'll do is we'll put them in after. Right. Next episode, we'll put the baffles in. Totally. The black smoke, no go. Well, you know, we, we, in the meantime, we could just tape this shut so it's not, you know. Yeah, 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 absolutely. Oh, you know what they do all the time? They put buckets on top of them. Yeah, yeah, the yeah, of course. Just in case. Yeah, we all got right. buckets. We got a Home Depot bucket. This is awesome. <laughs> awesome. All right, we'll put the baffles in. Yeah. There. No, the EPA will love us. Yeah, they, they shouldn't be that big of a deal. No. All right. Cool. Loki, though. This bed, everything's looking good. We put another coat, a uh, stain on here. Cleaning it right up. It's looking good. Hey, Dad. Hey, Brianna. What's going on? Oh, you know, the usual. Have a new truck. I do have a new truck. Yeah, I want you to check it out. Right. How's it feel to be a diva, Brianna? Honest to God. Honestly, How's it feel? It feels pretty amazing. Okay. But I feel like this is the life I deserve. Yep. You worked hard for it. Did I? Yeah, well. Let's see this. Oh. I came on theme. Yeah, look at you. Look at Brianna. Right? Look at her go. Look at her go. I'm an old lady now, so I have to match everything. Look at this. How close does it match? Actually, that's pretty close. It's pretty close. That is pretty good. Look pretty at you. Look at, look at Brianna go. Look at this. So, Brianna. Beautiful. This is the my, inside. Yeah, it's very, it's very rustic. So, Brianna, this is a quick overview of the truck. So, Steven and I just finished it. Mm -hmm. We installed this beautiful stack. And instead of the exhaust coming out of the side... We decided to put it going through here or there because it looks cooler. Maybe. Yeah, um, the scary black smoke doesn't yeah. look cool at all. <laughs> yeah, oh, yes, maybe, yeah. yes. Okay, thank, thank you very much. But the way we did it, we actually made a 90 degree bend in the exhaust and we made it shoot up and then that's how it does that. And then on the bed, we put we stained the bed like a deck. You know how like oh, decks have- Oh, it wasn't have, this color? No, it wasn't. It was like a, a natural wood color, but we stained it brown. That's actually pretty cool. That's pretty neat. Nice. Actually, is no. bending that is that like difficult to do? No, because we actually bought the pieces that were already ninety degree bent. Oh, we got cool. two of them, and then that straight piece was just a ten foot piece that we cut. Are That's you gonna it. make it like go faster? Make it electric? Do something weird? Not electric, no. Not Never. Gonna make it electric? No, because okay. it's a cool, it's a cool old truck. I mean, you you rode in it already. It's loud, but it's yes. Those are big tires. Yes, they are very big. What would you do if you had this truck? What would you do to it? What do I do to it? Yeah. Hmm. Clean the inside. Yep, okay. <laughs> um, I don't even know if it's possible, but when the when the smoke comes out black, yeah. it looks scary. It does. Only because you're like, huh, that black smoke is now in the universe. Right. And I I mean I don't even know if you can fix that. I can fi I can fix it. Yes. You can? Yeah, I can solve it from oh, the black smoke. Oh, I would definitely smoke. do that. Hmm. Um, but besides that, I mean, we already drove through the town with it, and every old man loves it. He likes some touch-ups. If you maybe, yeah, actually, no, it, it completes the look. It's a farm truck, so it's very. You don't want it to look too new. But it doesn't have to look dirty and gross. Yeah, I, I, yeah. People like this look, though, Brianna. People actually pay money for this look. Yeah. Like those Balenciaga sneakers. Have you seen those? No, I have not. They, they're like homeless people's shoes. Really. 
it looks like. Do you want them? No. Okay. It looks like a pair of shoes. There's like whole. Remember how Kanye was doing like his Yeezy brand? Yeah, yeah, like yeah. Holes and stuff? Looking homeless, yep. It's that, but way more extreme. Like these shoes look like they've been through a dumpster fire. Like poverty shoes. Okay. Literally. And they're probably a thousand dollars a piece. Two thousand. Really? I think they're eighteen hundred something like that. Yeah, I, I Balenciaga. Would, I wouldn't know about expensive stuff. I'm more of. A, I wouldn't like. I have New Balances on. I feel special. No, these. those are nice. Thank you. Those thank are you. Shoes thank I you. Got. Thank you. Thank you. But yeah, maybe like doesn't have to destroy the farmer vibe. Yeah. But like, would you keep the same color? I mean, orange is my favorite color. Okay, perfect. So of course, but I don't think it needs a lot. Just maybe. Maybe gray smoke instead of black. Oh, I could do gray. I could do that. <laughs> gray. We'll and then just at least the inside. Yeah. Okay. Very least the inside. All but right. It's a pretty cool truck. All right. Well, I'm glad you like it, Brianna. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thanks for getting it in my favorite color. Cheese. <laughs>